Hello, Cancer. <sighs> y'all, this is the second time I'm doing y'all read it. First, let me say, everything in this video, it may not resonate with you. The details may be different. You have to uh, switch the roles sometimes. If I'm saying he, it could be a she or vice versa. Um, it's your job to discern and get in where you fit it in the story or to figure out if you in the story at all. But it's the second time I'm doing this reading because this has happened several times. This is the third time to be exact where... Somebody was trying to masquerade as who you're supposed to be with, your divine partner. Okay? I started off the reading speaking about how you're going to be visited by some sort of spirit. Okay? Um, it, 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 show me the spirit. I'm going to be honest with you. The spirit feel like your ex that is like projecting into your space. Okay, show me. Show me who is Yeah, this is somebody who you don't who you who you have them on. I'ma literally I'ma use that word literally restriction. Like whoever this mm -mm. I heard P U S S Y punishment. Especially with this lady right here holding her legs closed. Like you could say like you'll never you like I'm hearing somebody say like you'll never touch me again. You'll never touch me again. But the crazy thing is that all this person could think about is touching you with the devil and the ace of swords. That's all they could think about is touching you. That's all they can think about. Somebody is like, babe, you know you fine, don't you? Babe, you know you fine. You could do bust down middle part or bob. Baby, you know you fine or some shit like that. Or go blonde. <clears throat> Excuse me. This person like like your style. Okay. Let me tell you how we start talking about this person. First of all, I was speaking about with the Ten of Pentacles and the Lovers here. I was just speaking about how your ancestors are pushing you, literally pushing you to some sort of divine partnership that is going to be long-lasting, fruitful. Okay? Love of my life, you are my friend. I can't depend right all that good stuff but with the death in the four of cups somebody is not trying to take no for an answer somebody's not trying to take that i'm not dealing with you for an in i won't fuck with you for an answer but the thing about it is they're not really saying nothing i don't see them saying anything that's the part that really like what was like hmm so i thought it was like a new a new person with like that was like a secret admirer with the new love and honeymoon but that's not it what it is is that this person knows that this new love is here for you you could be already dealing with this new love and like they're like actually projecting with this patience and solitude like this person is like literally like trying to enter into your space and they they saying like and i don't believe them I believe that this is how they feel, but I don't, they're, they're, they're not like on some changed man type stuff. Okay. They're saying with the friendship and community here that you could have met this person through a friend or a friend of the family or something like that with friendship and community. But like, they feel like, oh, I was a fool and yeah, yeah, yeah. And all I can do is think about you. Feelings. You got me in my feelings. Um, in that song, he says, baby, it's as obvious, you know, that I'm in love with you, Ooh, girl, heart's been racing just to see you. I keep my eyes closed just to feel you, darling. I keep, I keep my eyes closed just to feel you. Like somebody is trying to come and visit you spiritually. Baby, it is unimaginable the feelings I feel for you. Ooh, I'm getting a sex was good between you and this person. Oh, I don't like it because I feel like they're trying to have sex with you in the astral. They look, 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 look at this uncontrolled feelings. You see this energy of well being as well. Like, you see her laying there. Like, this person is going to try to come and visit you if they haven't already while you're sleeping. With the look at this, look at this, and dark thoughts. Like, what, what, 
you know, I just, I don't like it. And, and they're trying to masquerade as somebody who, you know, is, is your actual partner who is on their way. You're in separation with this person. If the, if the actual partner is not on their way, you're already dealing with them. And this person knows it because you have new love and honeymoon over here. You can meet this, this person near water or something like that. What else do you want to say about this person? And then we're going to go to the new person. They, they, you on their mind bad. Like, it's bad. They don't want to feel like this. They, they, they don't. They don't. And I feel like, um, they try to do you dirty spiritually. Listen, I will never forget. Um, one of the reads that I did for y'all was like, oh, cancer, somebody is using blood and roses to manifest you. Or something like that. And this was on my other channel, Star Child ET. I don't post on there anymore. But um, if y'all want to go over there as a backup, y'all could go, go ahead. Star Child ET is the name of the channel. Show me this, the old person, please. Hi. You didn't knock. My cat just walked in. Look at them. Look at this person. This is what they're doing. Using astral projection. They sad. They feel like um you, you not robbed them, but I should say you are depriving them of your energy. They love your energy. I don't know if it's like, it's something here too, like with the eight of swords. Like, look, look at y'all. We got eight, eight, eight here. We have eight, eight, eight. Can y'all see? Child, I'm recording with the oldest phone ever. Because my other phone is dead. Um, yeah. Like, and I don't like it because it's at night. It's at night that they're doing this, leaving their body to come and visit you. This person with the four of pentacles and the six of cups, they won't let go. They holding on to the past. It's not even you no more. This is not, you don't like, you don't want to deal with this person. You don't. You don't. You think of them as a fool and they think of themselves as a fool. Let's see, like, what do they, what, uh, I don't, I don't. I mean, I really just don't know. What does this person want? What do they want? They want to spy on you. I just saw a piece of the page of swords. Like, they want to spy. They want to know if you're dealing with this person. Sometimes when you break up with people or when you don't deal with them anymore and you have already given them... Um, Uh, a lot of chances or whatever and like you finally cut them off sometimes they like wait a minute why are you resisting me now how can you resist me it must be somebody else like people like I, I don't like I see a lot of people who don't do their healing work after like a breakup they don't say oh why why did I what did I do how did I contribute or well, take accountability like this person it feels like is automatically Thinking that you got somebody else, but then also they do see it. They see it. So whoever this is got spiritual intel, okay? Because I see it. <laughs> and I, I see it, and I see that that's what they looking for. Show me this, the old person. What do they want? Hold on a second, y'all. Reconciliation with the temperance energy. Look at this Five of Pentacles. Like, the Five of Pentacles came out three times already. Like, it just feels to me like, you know, <clears throat> I want your energy. I, I want you, you know, nobody do me like you, especially sexually. Like, they really, like, they really have you on their mind 24-7, especially sexually. Four of Pentacles is out here again, okay? And the Three of Pentacles, they want to work together with you. I feel like they want financial stability or something, too. That got to do with money. Look, nine of pentacles and a five of swords. Like I say. You, you, you been running through my mind all day. You been running through my mind all day. 
You been running, you been running, you been running, you been running, you been running through my mind all day. Is what I'm hearing. And then when I got when I got with this energy of beauty, um, what? Child, my cat. Seven of Swords and the Three of Swords. Like this person hurt you, and they know they did, but they only hurt themselves by hurting you. Like and when and whatever, yeah, page of wands. You laced up, you laced up them skates and rolled right out their life. But they got obligations. What's the emperor? I'm hearing on that song with Tory Lanez, and I said this before. You curved the fuck out of me, baby. Some nerve you ducked out on me, baby. Shot my shit down with three AKs. Give no fucks not from me, baby. And I'm keeping it G, baby. Gotta replay you how you play me, baby. Gotta repay you how you pay me, baby. But Mario says, you want, you want a nigga that'll appreciate you. Have them rolling, then you go and put your skates on. I love you more than they could ever love you. Appreciate a nigga. That make me want to do something. Oh, the okay. Okay, so the song is, I could hear your heart crying out for me. Tory Lanez remixed that song. This person's heart is crying out for you. If whatever heart they got, I, I don't know. This person could be trying to work out and keep their mind off of you or work and keep their mind off of you. They cannot. They cannot. They just can't. It's not. And, 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 and with the chariot um here, like, I see you running. I see you running from this person, not wanting to be bothered with them. They want to come back and reconcile. They do. This person looking up spells or uh, going in their in they, in they grimoire, trying to figure out what it's going to take. What will it take, my love, to show you? Okay? You could be hearing songs. They could be trying to reach you through songs that you may hear or whatever. But I really feel like there's nothing that they could do. Okay? Let's move forward to this new love. Show me new love. Your ancestors want you to stay hopeful. Okay? Um... And be positive because that's what's going to help to bring this new person in if the new person didn't um, come in already. You're being free from this situation where this person was trying to hold you back. Like, it just feel like, especially with this restriction here, it just feel like, all right, it's over. What? What? This is a person that it, it seemed like they tried to have you so stuck and in love with them. And now the shit backfired. Now they stuck and in love with you. But they had bad intentions for you. And we, they weren't appreciating you. Show me new love and honeymoon, please. Whoever this new love is, they're going to be very healing to your heart and soul. Talent guides. Y'all, I've been telling you that there's a man here that's coming in for certain people in a collective um, who sings, dance, got some sort of talent, okay? It could be a communicator, somebody from a, a radio or something, a radio station. This could start out as a collaboration with music or something like that. This could start out as a collaboration. Maybe, you know, you get with this person for whatever. That have to do with work. I'm getting Leo energy. I, I believe Leo got this. Yes, Leo got this. Okay. So I, I'm, I heard you match my fly. You match my fly. So freedom is freedom is here again. Like you're going to drop. Somebody else had this. You're going to drop the zero and get you a hero. But I feel like yeah. Tell me yeah. There's something here that you found out that was it that that helped you uh set free you you could have broke cords because here go this person again with this dark thoughts and and this person he goes back and forth in, in, in between realms okay watching you and then 
you know, going back in his body, then coming out to watch you when they go back in his body. And I remember I say that this, and this was in cancer as well. You could go back and look. I said, um, the title of the video is somebody's going to astral project and it's going to be the last time they astral project. Show me hidden truth, something unknown, please. Something was exposed with the sun. Something was exposed. What was it? Like I said, you found out something about this person is what it feel like. What is that? These cards is jumping out. Show me. Something that... um. something that was exposed about this person that um made you withdraw your energy okay and it, and kind of like uh, you know it it was like i'm done like there was something that was like oh for real a word i am done with you okay and you and you left them in the five of pentacles you could have even figured out how badly they were affecting your energy or that they were a vampire or whatever okay show me fulfillment yeah it makes me feel like um this person only wanted you for personal gain whether it be energetically financially or what have you it really does feel spiritual okay yeah with the miracles and abundance this is giving me like a siphoning type energy okay yeah this person could come in and take what they want and then leave and leave get that bread get that hay then leave is what i'm getting something here about this person trying to make you stay stuck in the past as it pertains to them don't go nowhere wrap you up and save you for later here go this miracles energy again okay so this is like in this yeah this is like energetic thievery you know yeah, with the inner knowing, as I say that, you know that there's something out there better for you. Like, I don't know if you if you got this during a dream, a download, or what have you. You know, yeah, especially with this mem memories, energy, and potential, and illumination. Like, something told you, something told you to turn away from this person. They only want to take your power back. They only want to use you. They only scoping out the scenery to try to steal your light. Like, what can you give to them? What can you give to them? Like, what, what what do you have for them? You found out that there was something better and it made you drop the zero. You know, you knew that you were going to um, embark upon, upon some sort of journey and, and be with somebody better. Show me the better man, please. They don't they don't like giving me the information or, or you know, because or anything further than what I've already, you know, been telling y'all about for the past couple of months pertaining to this new love energy. It's like, it's a mystery. Um, it came up in two other zodiac signs, and I believe it was Sagittarius and Taurus, I believe. Um, but they won't say too much. It, it literally, the card of mystery came out a few times. Show me. New love. Give your relationship a chance. Somebody, this person could squint a lot that you're um that you're going to be dealing with that's new. It's safe for you to love and passion. Like this person is going to sweep you off your feet. I keep getting this energy of this Fabio in it. Like, I'm too sexy for like I don't know. Like somebody could be dealing with a uh, 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 I keep getting this white man. And he handsome too. Probably not your uh your regular usual type. But I feel like he is aesthetically pleasing. We have religious factors. Getting to know each other. Sorry, I hurt my back. And flirt, okay? So with, a, with the religious factors here, I really do feel like this is uh, ordained by God, okay? Some of you like... Show me. Show me religious factors.
So some of, some of you guys, um, your ancestors are bringing y'all together. Here we go again. Yeah, grace and death. Yeah, they're 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 putting this together for you. That's back to what I had said in the beginning. Like they're orchestrating this divine meeting, and it's gonna be beautiful. Okay, and you're not supposed to know too much about it. Self control, partnerships, and love. I feel like you gotta play this one real cool, y'all. <laughs> You have to you have to play this one real cool. Don't do nothing to mess it up. You know what I mean? Stay in your highest vibration. Sometimes when you like um a person, for some people, when you like a person a lot, it'll it'll bring out like toxicity in you. Like, hmm, where you was at? Why you didn't answer your phone? Or you know, type of energy or overthinking, overthinking or whatever. So just be careful with that. Show me self-control. Just be careful with that. Live and learn, okay? Yeah, it's like you, 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 you've experienced <laughs> whoever you are. You be flying off at the hand doing relationships sometimes. Oh my god! What? I usually have like lunch for him. Like I give him breakfast lunch and dinner and I usually have lunch for him but I don't have any more dry food and he's like very pissed okay yeah family so this is something that's ordained by your ancestors I mean it's gonna they, they trying to help you with this situation so they want you to treat it and handle it with care right I hope that helped 